himself right back on the verge of becoming the man. He has seen it before. He has done it. He has been here. He recognizes the knows that the change is necessary. We're done in the gym. He's ready. He's prepared. He's sure. He knows in his mind that by the end of the night, he's holding the championship pool. And there was a time when this division... Octagon tonight. So here is the former champion, Shogun Hill. He really has added to his legend late in his career. I love the team. Nice movement to avoid some of those strikes from the top. He's got to be careful here. Oh, right into Mount. Adesanya's in half guard. Drops down inside the now setting up a sub here. Oh, compromising spot here. Triangle choke is locked in. Oh, nice. And he's back up. With conviction to the body. Back and forth we go. And now Adesanya makes it up a little bit. We'll see what he can offer on the canvas. I mean, he can do it all. He's long told us that he has a great ground game. Nobody has four. That punch right there. His opponent's compromised, DC. It's one thing to land a hard shot. It's another thing completely to land a perfect shot. That was a perfect shot. Just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. All right, we set it inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 14 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed USC light heavyweight champion of the world, Israel, the last style bender.